Dad, guess what? What is up everyone and welcome back to some Super Mario Maker. Now, as you can tell from the title, I'm continuing my Panga Saga to conquer his passive levels. And we only have two left, so hopefully I can get those out of the way in this episode and we can move on to the other ones. But we'll see, because I know one of, them, one of them is the cape one, and I mentioned before, but I'm fucking terrible with the cape. Uh, I don't even remember how to use it properly, so we'll see. Oh my god, that's over one million attempts. Jesus Christ. Okay, so the two I have left is the cape one, as I just mentioned, and it is coin gathering one. And looking at this little thumbnail, looks like... Uh, it's not going to be as simple as jump into the coin. I'm going to have to knock stuff into it and whatnot. I didn't even know hitting a bomb into the coin gathered it. That's uh, interesting news. Okay, I'm probably already fucked up because I hesitated. Okay. How many coin? Okay. How many coins is that? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, fucking ten. Okay, um... It's gone. Yep. Typical Panga. There's probably a uh, hidden block right there somewhere. So I'm guessing I have to go right away, jump off of it, get bounce off this right here. Get that. Go over here. It probably. Uh, I would assume I have to get him, but maybe I don't. Maybe I just jump right off. I'm gonna just bounce off him. See where that what that does. Ooh. Huh. Oh, I absolutely need to have that. Okay, so you clearly can't land back on the platform. Well, maybe you can, actually. Just do a big jump. There we go. <laughs> okay, well, we know how to get it now. Um, with Panga levels, like... You're always supposed to just go, 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 you know, there's not really any times to stop, so I was kind of surprised that... Um... Okay. <laughs> I see what to do, I think. Oh, that works. Oh, that didn't work, because... <laughs> ah, didn't throw it well, far enough to the right. It makes me sad to know that, like, when I have that magical run, I'm getting it all. I'm just gonna hit a Kaizo block at the very last part of it and have to do it all over again. Fuck. Alright, just keep going for now. <sighs> I see what to do. That might be the... Oh, you have to eat that coin, too. Yes, I got that one, finally. I missed that one. <laughs> oh no. <sighs> that saddens me very greatly, but at least we know it's not that bad getting there. Yes. Yes, perfect. Things are going swimmingly. No! <laughs> ah, that was looking so good too. All right, but that's fine, because I'm getting a lot better at this beginning part. Now that I said that, I'm going to die embarrassingly. <laughs> there it was. Yes! Oh my god, thank you. That, was, that wasn't too bad. Okay, uh, down to the tunnel. I'm surprised it's not a forced hit. It might be right here. Well, it doesn't matter, because I don't know what the fuck I'm doing. Uh, <laughs> um... Okay, so I'm supposed to bounce off the turtle, get up there, grab the helmet. I don't know if I put it on or not. I'm guessing not. Then it'll, uh, the shell will then bounce off the springs. I'll bounce off it down there. I'm going to not put the helmet on just because that's probably not what you're supposed to do. Fuck. Oh, I'm supposed to throw it up there, I guess? Yeah, it has to be. No. <laughs> you gotta go through the tunnel first, Zachary. Mm. 
Okay, hit that. Ah, oh, fucking, I was supposed to spin. Now we know. I don't know what I was expecting to happen. I don't- No! Almost did it again. Not that it would have been that big of a deal, but it would have been embarrassing. <sighs> Fuck! Uh, how do I get that one? Whoa, okay. Was not expecting that to happen. Was I supposed to... Um, what? Was I supposed to grab that shell, or... I think I am supposed to grab it, I'm just, you know, not. Oh my god! So I gotta, gra I gotta grab it, throw it up, and stop, and then spin. You know what I mean? Maybe I should just throw it and see what happens. Maybe that's what I'm supposed to do. You know, I'm starting to wonder if the shell is just a fucking troll. Because if you throw it right away, you kill the bomb. If... If you... Land on it, then you go into the spike. You know what I mean? Oh, finally. I I don't I don't need the shell I don't think I think that is literally just a troll. Uh, I didn't see a situation in there where it would have benefited me. Shit. <laughs> yeah, I think that I think that must be it. You throw the P switch on top of the blocks, the thwomp will go down, and activate it, but that doesn't really matter. Oh, I had to wait. Damn it. I don't know why. You just get trained in Panga levels to just go, 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 you know? Um, I know I rhymed. That's pretty cool. But, like, when there's those moments where you're supposed to, like, stop for a second, it's just weird. Oh god. I was supposed to hit him right first. This level's pretty cray cray, huh, Dad? <laughs> Do you ever use the word cray cray? No? You probably should. <laughs> oh god, oh my god! In this situation, one would be triggered, Dad. <sighs> I don't know why, but I'm, I just keep expecting the bomb to like bounce back towards me when it just it's, it's just gonna go straight up. I need to remember that going over there. And I don't know if I'm on a timer with the P switch. Whoa, whoa. <sighs> that was it. I just I just got too crazy. I got too frisky. I always get too frisky. I don't know if I'm on a timer with the P switch. Oh, I thought I was gonna hit by. No, that's what that was. It was on the timer, and I, my brain just thinks that's too obvious. I'm gonna get trapped in there. It's just a troll, so I avoided it. On a scale of how hard this level is, from one to my nipples when I eat caramel. This is probably about like when you forget to wrap up cheese and it gets hard. It's probably right about there right now. What is that? What is that? What am I doing? I'm just so worried. There's 100% there's a Kaizo block in there somewhere. And all I can think about it is how my dumb face is going to smack right into it. No, fuck you, you shell bastard. Oh, you bastard. You guys, I just thought if 
If I had gotten that coin and gone through that door, there's only one coin left to get. And if I get all the coins and fuck up, I have to do the whole level over. And if Panga does something to where that is a possibility, to where like, you can mess up and like he troll- or like he trolls you or something and gives- Ugh, oh, I'm gonna cry. Yes! Oh my god, thank you. Wait, I'm missing one somewhere then. I, know, I saw it. You saw it? Yeah. It's under one of those crab things. Well, no, I got that. I think. <gasps> no, you're right! You're right! Now I now it all makes sense. That shell wasn't bullshit. That one, right? Dear God, I had to throw the shell backwards. Oh my God, this whole time. See, it just takes a second eye sometimes. Well, I have two, so a third eye. Oh, fuck. Oh, I would have had it. And I can guarantee there's people in the comments like, how do you not notice that? I mean, I noticed it. I noticed the the thing, but I don't know why my I, I just there's just so much stuff happening. I was like, somewhere in there is probably being get getting got. Oh, there it is. Yeah, that's not that's not that hard though. That's that doesn't really change much. So I'm not too upset by that. Yeah, when I was saying like when I go through the door, I have one coin left. I don't know why, but I just for some reason I assumed it was a regular door. And he had like a safe coin or something. Oh, yes. Get through that door now, boy. Okay, sorry. I'm just... I'm fucking nervous right now. Yatta! <laughs> Oh my god, that took way longer than it should have. I can't believe I was going so long not registering that I wasn't getting that coin. Like, I saw it, I acknowledged it the very first time I saw it, like, I went by it. But there's just so much stuff happening, I was like, somewhere in there I probably threw something behind me to, and I got it or so. I don't know, I don't know what I was thinking. Stop, stop yelling at me, stop judging me. Quit nagging me. Okay, so let's slap that flag on there, that clear. And uh, now we only have one more to go for the passive panga levels. Um, the cape one, as I mentioned, is the last one. And I'll, I'm going to do that probably next week, I, I think. And then once once I do that, I'll give... I don't know. I might give one of his other ones a shot. It, it'd honestly be better to stream the, uh, the attempt, I feel like. Just because if what other YouTubers say how it can take like 10 hours to beat it, uh, I honestly don't... I don't know. I don't feel like it'd take that long. But we'll see. Um, who knows? Maybe maybe at some point when streaming becomes available to me, I will stream playing that. But okay, a lot of people haven't really gotten the memo yet. So I'm going to say this now. Uh, I cannot stream right now because my laptop does not, ha it can't handle good quality with good frame rate. And I've, I've tried it at 720p, 30 frames a second, and which I feel like is the minimum standard that I want to have. And it couldn't do it. It, it. it did it for about seven seconds, and then it said that you're, it can't support it. Um, and it crashed. It, it stopped the stream. So I can't do it until I upgrade. And that's that's why I'm starting the Patreon, is to go towards that. And also, I have been seeing the comments and people messaging me saying they don't want to go through Patreon, but they want to like do a donation of like $15 or whatever, just like a one-time thing. And maybe whenever they get a chance, they'll do more. So I've heard, I've heard, I hear you, and I'm gonna set up a PayPal thing on my YouTube channel. Um, I haven't done it at this moment, but I'll set it up there. So for those of you who just want to do that one-time donation, you can. So, you know, and I appreciate you guys wanting to do that. It's really cool. Like we, I have some people, some people have started on Patreon. Um, others, like I said, have personally messaged me saying they they want to, but can't do it not through that. So it's just super cool to see the support coming in. Uh, so thank you for that. Interesting how 0.46% clear rate just all just doesn't seem that bad anymore. Yeah, see, the one I made right now has a 0.02 clear rate. That's just 
Ugh, that's gross. And, uh, funny thing is, I'll, I'll, I'll admit it now since it's been long enough. Um, when I was getting a lot of comments of people saying, like, you're garbage of this game and stuff like that, I was like, I'm going to make a fucking really difficult level that's purely, in, like, skill involved and uh, see how many people can beat it. Like, that was basically my retaliation to be like, all right, if you're better than me, prove it. You know, that's why, that's why I made the level. Um, clearly, a lot of people are struggling with that very beginning part, as you can see with the X's. But, yeah, for, like, for the people who say, like, I'm bad at the game, like, give this level a try. You know, if you can beat it, then you're at the very least at least as good as me. You know what I mean, but if you can't beat it, well then uh, shut your goddamn mouth. <laughs> anyway, as you can see, my camera's dead. But anyway, I hope you guys enjoyed this episode of Super Mario Maker, and I'll see you in the next video.